the latest update gave us some nice features at the mines. They added the supermine, which is not open yet, but I'll bet you get more um, crystals from it. And also they added the feature, which you can see already if you look in the luck record, the oath fragments. What can you do with these fragments? Well, let's have a look. You go here to the main hand and there on the bottom left you can enter. And here you can see already all the nice weapons that are available for each commander. Let me show you first what those fragments do. Here, I already collected five and if I have a hundred, I can redeem this nice weapon. Which will take me some time because I had five in, in the last two days it was open. So if it's ten per week, you need about ten um, full weeks to get them. But we can have a look at all the weapons which are there. Jamie Lannister, of course, is a very nice weapon. Because um, when all allied lineups receive healing, the line up normal attack changes to weakness attack for 5 seconds. Very nice to have. We already know the one from Rob Stark from before. Recovery attack increased. You see here Arya, which just has her damage being increased. We have Sonara, which is an increasement of additional times that she attacks. We have Vela, which if it's up to me because I use female uh, a lineup, I really would love to have that because it simply means the active skill will be used more. It'll actually use more, there's a higher chance of getting it used more. Soren knew that also from before, he just gets more stuff from gathering. Chris, the first one, yep, more defense. We have Annie, which is also not that bad. She will just wipe out more of the, the enemy army. And there's even more to it. If there's a disarmed status, she also has a chance to hit something else. Peter Baelish. 8 weakness attacks, 25 seconds after battle begins, and you have disharmony and cursed status on all enemy commanders, which is not bad. We've got Haley. Oops, let me go up here. Here she is. There will be then a 50% chance to get immunity, and there will be healing for 10%. Coral, of course. The target's defense is decreased by 3.5% for every time a spearman hits. Theon, we knew him from before he was good for city defense, so he has indeed more troops. Most likely he will be able to join the battle with an increased attack. Raymond will have an increased training speed, reset speed and defense. And finally we we'll have Hector. So of course we have already there was a big chance for healing and now that the chance just increased. Also the attack is increased. So the oath fragments we were able to get that Chris with them soon and for the other ones. Well, since they mentioned it here already, um, the oath, they should come up in those mines sooner or later. So then in the end, if you have time, patience and enough luck, you will be able to get all the weapons. And looking already at the stats, Layla, um, for sure. Then also we have um, Jamie those weapons, they will make a huge, huge impact. So, I bet, um, looking at this, knowing that so many fragments, also knowing that you'll lose more troops in the supermine, I bet many of these fragments you will be able to get from the supermine. It comes with a risk, but I think it's worth it.